Hey guys, I go by the name of Illuminous Eyes. I'm here to illuminate the motherfucking wise, okay? Today we have a really quick message. This one's gonna be for Aries. Aries, we're gonna be using a different deck. It's called the Householder's Deck, okay? So, we're gonna be using this one. I mixed them with the Soulmate Deck, so we're gonna see how this one works. This will be my first time interpreting them with you, so take the ride with me and let's see how this one goes, okay, Aries? Can I get a message for Aries? Can I get one message, please, for Aries? One message please for Aries okay Aries the soulmate card came out it says the reason it hurts so much to separate is because our souls are connected okay so hmm, whose energy am I getting off of this I'm getting Aquarius Gemini energy off of this it says in the overall deck it says in the end you tried you cared and sometimes that's enough so you could be connecting with a um uh, a fellow fire sign like a Leo okay so I'm getting I'm getting that your feelings is hurt okay someone could be hurting your feelings Aries or vice versa but I feel like this is you you try to you try to thing that's what I heard I tried a thing yeah I mean I feel like you tried something and you felt very connected to someone you felt like they were your soulmate you felt like they were the one but I feel like in the end they end up hurting your feelings just know that it was enough you did you did what you could you put a foot forward okay that's really what i'm getting about it i'm, I'm getting your i i feel like you say i feel like i'm sorry rambling i feel like i hear you saying look me in the eyes all right or like you want you want someone to 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 like face you in a sense okay like like i said you could be connecting with a, a gemini aquarius or a leo okay could you tell me more messages please for aries can you tell me more messages, please, for Aries? Yeah, the lovers in reverse. Okay, so I'm, I'm getting that you guys, you guys probably started a connection off with someone really well. The chemistry was awesome. I always think of salt and pepper as great gr ingredients that go together. What goes better than salt and pepper? But you came in reverse. So I'm getting like maybe the chemistry is off with you guys. Okay, so I'm also getting that you guys could have tried to step out of your comfort zone um, into another race. I'm looking at black like a black and white um couple okay i'm getting that you you were really connected with someone but maybe maybe this connection is not working anymore okay maybe maybe the fact that <clears throat> you guys come from two separate backgrounds does it's like you guys can't come to terms you guys can't agree okay maybe you guys are maybe you guys are going to choose to separate even though you guys actually love each other it's just not going to work and you're going to choose to let bygones be bygones aries Okay, you could be connecting with a, a, a Libra or, or Gemini, like I said earlier. Yeah, so the, over, the another card that fell out, it says, I have found the one that my soul loves, but it did come in re reverse. So again, lovers in love, I, I feel like I feel like you're, this situation just doesn't work for you guys anymore, okay? You guys are not connecting right now. Maybe it's just temporary, okay? overall deck it says your life does not get better by chance it gets better by change okay so maybe maybe it's just maybe this is just a temporary um hiccup or rough patch in your relationship right now with an air sign okay maybe maybe you guys have to find a, another way to relate or come together or you know communicate okay maybe you guys really are each other's like soulmate or uh i'm getting more so twin flame here but I'm, I'm, I'm getting that you guys are supposed to be here in each other's life to change each other in a sense Okay, teach you got teach each other something maybe about communication getting a lot of air energy here I'm actually hearing little Wayne how to love You had a love mm -mm, break your heart <laughs> How to love Oh how to love so maybe this person's supposed to teach you how to love okay or maybe i'm actually getting a lot of air energy like i said so maybe this person's supposed to teach you how to love and then detach okay how to accept change okay so you, you could definitely be connecting with a, a, a an aquarius or gemini moving on i'm, all, I'm also getting even though this is air energy i'm seeing Okay, um, I'm I'm getting the sense of Scorpio energy too. Yeah, Wheel of Fortune, the em Emperor. Okay, so uh, yeah, you could Aries. I feel like I feel like you are you are supposed to be teaching someone about something in their life. 
over again overall deck the reason it hurts so much is to separate is because our souls are connected Aries you could be older than this person and they're younger than you and they're having a hard time letting go or this is you I'm also getting Aries you're hitting a Saturn return you're getting older I feel like you're going through a, a um, like a shift a spiritual shift or something a Saturn return I don't know how else to explain that I feel like the Saturn return is kicking your ass or you're coming you're coming up to a Saturn return excuse me you're coming up to a Saturn return I'm getting I'm getting your Saturn returns going to hurt cuz you're going to have to separate from someone You could be an empath and you and you could feel you could feel a shift getting ready to come up Aries Also, I'm, I'm also getting like you can someone is like um, I'm not sure if this is you Aries or if this is someone else but I'm, I'm getting like someone is like um, giving me six of cup energy like this could be um, a Libra or an Aquarius but I feel like someone is like really missing you and they're going to come back this person may feel like you guys have been separated for too long I feel like someone here has still has a soul tied to you in a sense. And the connection's not over. This is the cards that I'm looking at. If you if you've been feeling really sad if you've been getting really emotional I feel like this person is like sending you like energy to feel like that you guys are still connected so I feel like Aries someone's going to return before the end of the um before the mercury retrograde is up and even if the mercury retrograde is up i feel like this person is still going to return to you because they're still tied to you it says i have found the one that my soul loves and it's in reverse yeah it's an air sign i keep getting um the number is 9-3. I feel like I'm getting a birth date. Or your birthday, 3-9. Someone's birthday is 3-9. March 9th. I feel like if someone's birthday is on March 9th, I feel like you're going to hit a, a really harsh, sad in return with your soulmate. So if this person, if you're going through a breakup right now, don't worry, they're going to return. Others of you, I feel like you are going to go through a harsh breakup with, with your soulmate or with your twin flame, rather. I feel like this is a twin flame more so. gonna be forewarning you especially for those of you with the this I, I mean this could either be for someone's birthday that's on um March 9th or my, March 3rd 
because I'm hearing the 3rd of March or the, the 9th of March. Just know it's going to hurt. But it'll be over soon. Just cry that shit out. All right. 